What's up, everybody? We're at Staff for 2021. We're in the DeWalt booth, and we got new battery technology. We're gonna hear all about from this guy right here. Right, We're with Sean. See ya. He's gonna tell us all about the Power Stack lithium battery packs. It's all right here, and it's all coming right up. After this message from our sponsor, DCG Construction. Want to help out with the channel? Head on over to the merch store. You can get hats, hoodies, t-shirts. Link will be in the description below. Welcome back, everybody. My name is Vince. We have Sean, and he's going to run us through the newest battery technology in the industry. In my opinion, this is going to change everything. It'll never be the same ever again. What can you tell us about it, Sean? We think so. Well, thank you. And so we're really excited to be here at Stafta introducing the DeWalt PowerStack 20 volt max compact battery. It's the world's first to use a totally new type of technology in the pack, which is a lithium ion pouch cell. Now this is something that we, over a matter of years in development, uh, have brought that brings you really big benefits versus the cylindrical cells that we and all of our competitors have used for batteries to date. Now, a lot of people don't realize these cells were never made for power tools. The number one user of these cells is actually the electric vehicle industry. And when it comes to power tool applications, there's two big limitations of it. One is from a performance perspective. There's a very small surface area on the end of the cell that limits your power throughput. And you also need a separate component inside of the pack to make the electrical connections, which introduces inefficiency. Okay. These pouch cells have large surface area connective tabs, which gives high power throughput potential. And then they're then directly laser welded to each other inside of the battery and then stacked up to create a highly powerful, highly efficient pack. Wow. And so you can see they're literally stacked up inside like that, which is where the name power stack comes from. Now that all translates to a battery that's gonna give you 50% more power than the compact batteries that we had before. But the other big limitation of these kinds of cells is if you think about trying to put cylinders into a pack that has a rectangular shape, you end up with all these empty spaces in between all the cells, and that results in a battery that's gonna be a lot bigger and heavier than it really had to be. Makes great sense. And we designed these to be rectangular and flat shaped so there's no wasted space inside of the pack, which is then translating to the 25% smaller size and 15% less weight than before. Now, we actually, again, custom designed this cell specifically for power tool applications and exclusively for DeWalt power stack. Wait, can I, can I hold you up? Yeah, yeah. I wanna hold you up because that's been a, a very, uh, well, that's been a question that's come up over right. and over again. Right, right. A lot of people have experience with radio controlled cars yeah. or they had an experience where they bought a cell phone previously. Right. And, and, and they're wondering, can this cell be used in a power tool application where things will be dropped right uh, you know where where it's going to be maybe in their hot vehicle in the summertime or in the cold in the winter yeah but what i heard you say was and i correct me if i'm wrong this was a collaborative venture between you and the manufacturer of these cells to make this work and applicable to a power tool Right, that's exactly right. Okay. So, so this is something, because I've seen that same question a lot as well. Awesome. And to, to really be clear, you might see other things out there, like you said, in phones or in RC cars that sort of look like this. Right. But this is something that was made, developed over years. Oh, wait it's, a minute, you're saying that DeWalt a multi, is a multi-billion dollar company just didn't grab any cell, throw it into a battery pack? Right. Who would have thunk it? Who thought that? Unbelievable. Right? Yeah. No, it was developed specifically for power tool applications, exclusively for power stacks. So even though there are things that might look Look similar. This is something that has been tested in the lab. It's even been tested with real world users for months to get you know testing done ahead of time. And this is an incredibly powerful cell, incredibly reliable, highly performant, right? Now you can see one way to show all of our standard handheld power tools have a sort of geometry for the tool foot where the battery interface is. Yes. This battery, the power stack was designed to be exactly flush with all the sides of the tool foot so that if you're maneuvering around things in a tight space, it's much more maneuverable than something that's based on, for example, that 21 millimeter cell like this, where you see it's hanging over in the back and the sides. So that's that's a great point that you bring up. So a lot of people have been saying, yeah, I like the new atomic impact driver. Right. It's very compact. It's very compact, but some people have mentioned, but the battery sticks out right. way past the front of the tool. And I said, 
I think DeWalt has a solution for that. Look at how much more compact. You can see how perfectly it aligns with the tool. That is beautiful. And as you'll see in our booth, we have a new, new categories, new generations of tools across all categories that are smaller, more compact, more performant. But in the past, if you wanted more performance out of your battery, you had to trade off size and weight. Bigger and bigger. So this is why we're excited because we're the first people to ever bring simultaneously better power and more compact size, less weight, all in the same product. So let me ask you this. Why would you be putting your most pound for pound powerful battery with the atomic line of tools. Right. Well, it's something that in our field research, right, lots of contractors really value that less weight because if you're somebody that's working on repetitive applications all day long, working overhead, that more compact size with that performance is something that is less fatigue at the end of the day, more control precision with your tool, right? And in the past, what's the point of having a more compact tool if you had to put a battery that's this big on it to get the job done, right? It makes perfect sense. So now we've got a compact and powerful battery to go with that compact and powerful tool for that complete solution. So if I'm hearing you correctly, the Atomic Line is a contractor grade tool intended for contractors. Absolutely. Okay, and the important part with Atomic that I think is a great benefit is that it is compact and it is lightweight. It's gonna help with repetitive motions, overhead work. You know, I'm not getting any younger and I like the idea of a lighter weight tool day in and day out to get my jobs done. It's going to extend my lifetime in the trades. It's going to let me make more money over time. Absolutely. So a couple more things about the battery is that even though it's a totally new technology with the lithium ion pouch cell, yes. it's still lithium ion and it makes it compatible with 100% of the 20 volt max tools that we have. And it works with all the chargers that we have for that system. So the chemistry here is lithium ion. It's not like a polymer. Or exactly. So we got a lot of questions about that too. Once, once we announced is, oh, is it a lipo? Is it a lithium polymer? The technical definition of that is something that has a polymer electrolyte layer that's actually different technology. This has a liquid electrolyte layer, which is, means it's technically a lithium ion type of cell. Okay. Right? So again, that was something, this is something that we've been years in the making, engineered, tested for power tool applications exclusively for DeWalt PowerStack. It's going to be really performant and uh, we, we're really excited about I, it. I do have a question and I think that backwards compatibility is a great benefit. Yeah. But my question moving forward with this technology is, will you have a solution to more, more rapidly charge these batteries? Right. So today with PowerStack, yes. it, again, like I said, it works with all of our lithium ion battery chargers. You can charge this in a little bit over a half an hour. So it's a very rapid recharge yes. uh, as well. And, you know, so that's a technology that again. Any plans to like charge it in like five minutes? That's probably a little bit further down the road. I think Sean just skirted the question. He won't give us a, a clear cut answer, but I appreciate Nothing it. Nothing short term. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Sean. Yeah. So one other point on the battery is that this is the first DeWalt pack to have a rubber overmolded base, okay. which adds some extra impact protection, but it also protects your finished surfaces when you set the tool down versus something like this hard plastic where you can mark surfaces when you set it down on a finished workpiece. So that's another great benefit. It also has the three LED fuel gauge. And one thing that's nice is our batteries used to, when you take your finger off, immediately turn back off the light. You wanna live. I'm, when we made a video about this, and I talked about that, they're like, it's no big deal. Even Sean thinks it's a big deal that they stay well, on. Our users think it's a big deal. I and think they've it's told a big deal. Me. Yeah, so <laughs> that's another great benefit. And again, it's a three year warranty. So it's, you're gonna get a great lifetime out of it. But one other thing about this cell is that it has double the cycle life of the cylindrical type cells. So even though any new technology is gonna come with a little bit of a price premium, if you're getting double the lifetime out of the battery, that's a much better value long-term. I agree. So that's another great benefit of PowerStack. We have any demos? So there's lots of demos here at the show. We've got drilling demos, fastening, metal cutting, concrete. So let's do, let's do. I think you might have done the concrete can yesterday. Do yeah, sure. Are you doing them with me? Uh, sure. Well, I, I would like you to do them. Um, so one we can do here to start with is, why don't you try, one that I've been having people do is do three holes back to back as fast as you can with the two amp hour pack. And I can time you uh, and then repeat it with the PowerStack battery. So we're going speed two? Yep, speed two. And One just inch. do three back to back as fast as you can. And uh, oh, if, you, if, you, if you count down, I'll time you. One, two, three, go.
All right, so that was close to 14 and a half seconds. Just try the same thing with power stack. And then count down and I'll time you again. One, two. Fully charged, yep. Three, go. So that was eight seconds. So almost half the time with the power stack is what you did with the two amp hour and, battery. And, and literally, we didn't get much stalling with the two, but it's because I was just gauging the, the amount of pressure I could apply. Right. So I was letting the tools do the work. And you exactly. could see it. Yeah. The power stack gets it done in half the amount of time. Yeah, and you'll see the same thing play out across all of our different demos where you're gonna get your job done faster and you're gonna extend what you can do with the tool as well. Cause like you could feel with the one inch bit that two amp was probably starting to stall a little bit. Yeah. You can go to bigger and bigger bits with your tool and not stall with power stack. So that's doing more with your tool. Awesome. Yeah. Let's run more demos. All right. Now, did you guys do this one yesterday? Yesterday we did this side by side yeah. with, uh, with Jay. Okay. And we can get it more if you want. Let's get more. Because all we did yesterday was yeah. we ran the 5 8 uh, rotary hammer, okay. but we ran the power stack. Did you not say it? No, I was over my well, booth yesterday. We, yo, we ran, I thought maybe you looked over, drew a little crowd. We ran the power stack versus this. Ready? Yep. Three, two, one. So yeah, if you guys want to run this again, I definitely want to run it. One thing that we can do is if you set the depth gauge to say three inches or something on that, and then you can do it, you can time it back to back, right? Same kind of idea. Okay. And it'll drill faster versus the two. Is that fully charged? Nope, two. Uh, yeah, I can get you one that's full if you need it. There you Here's go. Here's full, right? Okay. Try the two amp, and then you can do one or two holes to the, the depth, and then and I can time it. One, two, three, go. All right, ten and a half. Ready? Yep. One, two, three, go. That was just uh, ten. Yeah, so you're a little faster on that. I stopped a little late, but yeah, just fair, under ten. Fair enough. Yeah. I think as the as the as the bits grow. Right, it, it's more of a difference. Yes. Yeah. yes, yes. I think maybe we should throw it on this. Let's do it. Can you imagine? So we can try over here on the bandsaw. We'll do great. Try with the power stack, see if you feel any difference with it. Yeah, I mean, that was seven and a half seconds. Did it feel any smoother or, or faster? I mean, I mean they're, they're, here's the thing, they feel great. Yeah. And, and, and the bandsaw feels good. Yeah. You know, I don't know. Maybe I just, you know, I just have a knack for making tools run good. I don't know. Let's see if we can just get it to store. <laughs> the power stack, you ready? Sean, full, full beast mode, Sean. <laughs> <laughs> the, atomic, the atomic pencil. This is really I, yeah. unbelievably powerful. Let's, you want to try the circular saw? Definitely. Let's go. Let's go. All right. Let's go try to break that real quick. All right. Okay. So you see it's stalling out. Okay. Yeah, that seemed like it felt pretty different. A lot different. Yo, that is full 
Beast mode, full send on that. That's unbelievable. Yo. Full, still full. How many cross cuts can you get out of this battery? I'd have to check, but it's a lot. Yeah, yeah. Can I keep going? Yeah, if you want to, keep going. That's unreal. That's unreal. Well, hey, thanks for uh, oh, coming man. by. Yo, did you see we got all mixed. I'm so excited. I don't know, fist bump, handshake, what you do up here in Stafford, bud? Let's handshake. There we go. Everybody, hope to see you on the next one. Video's over, but I know you want more. So this is how you're going to get it. First thing you need to do is pretend you're this guy, and you're here in the birthplace of freedom. Now ring that bell like it's 1776 and let all notifications through. What? You're not subscribed yet? Well, smash this button here. After that, watch this video here, here, and maybe over here. See you later.